Ayo, back on the wasteland today. First and foremost, I would like to say, uh, long live the underground paths that I have tread before. Also, um, I said something about running from wolves because they might not be worth it in like a previous stream, but in a broadcast even before that, I was talking about how I used to have the Three Wolf One Moon t-shirt and wolves are not to be scoffed at you know like in my mind somehow there are like some wolves who may actually uh, bolster one's like power and potential on their uh, individual journey and you know I would like to honor the ones who came before me who aided me and uh, powering up along the way. Whether they be wolves or whether they be lions. I usually do not pull up the atomic shop and stream anymore because there's a known copyright claim for this song, but. I forgot to change my icon today. Oh, also that reminds me, maybe I should change my hair. Change up my hair. All right, right now I got the Red Rocket Visionary icon. I'm gonna go to Vault Girl for a bit, I guess today. And then uh, tomorrow I might actually change it to the transgender pride flag icon. Tomorrow's the last day of my PlayStation Plus, so, you know, mm, I gotta get some gaming in. And today I'm going the pink pantsuit. Tomorrow I might go red polka dot dress. I'm not sure about changing up my hair here. Huh. Oh, and uh, I'm gonna do initiate of mysteries here. I am pivoting to that. It is what I kind of want to check out. Beneath Riverside Manor, I discovered the secret base of the Order of Mysteries. As a new initiate, I've been assigned a mentor. I'm supposed to meet her in Lewisburg. Alright, and uh, in terms of the explosive bait, I may or may not use that on a creature. Somewhere. Lewisburg is like way down. Way down here. On the way, I might be able to use my explosive baits. Had a number of occasions, uh, a number of places. It looks like maybe I'll swing by the, the wayward. That sounds like a good idea. Huh? What creatures are by the wayward? I know there are some mole rats. I said before that the Smash player, Dr. PP, might actually be like pretty high level, like in terms of power level. And I stand by that. I kind of checked out one of their, a little bit of the introductory section of one of their past streams. I have been using Twitch uh, more recently since I plan to switch to it. Or at least for a while. Check it out. Oh, chicken thighs, yes. Let me lick your thighs. 
Taylor Swift. But in terms of the whole Dr. PP situation, I remember there was another melee player who also had a P name. Their name was Plup. I watched a little bit of their stream. Also, hmm. I think I should cut through the woods. Even the map suggests it. And I think it's possible that, like, Plup is also of a high level. I tuned into one of their recent broadcasts and they were quite angry for some reason. They were. Uh, they were calling another player a little bud. They were like, uh, just uh, swearing a lot. They were also having trouble with their stream. <laughs> they were using a computer and they could not uh, figure something out for a little bit. That chicken thigh is gonna be so good. Maybe. <sighs> I even like wearing this pink pantsuit much better with the body I have now. I have been saying like a bit, you know, how much I'm glad that I changed my appearance, you know, did the whole sex change thing. But I've, uh, in my studies along my life journey so far, I realized that the process might not be as streamlined as it was here. Some people have complications. And then uh, even if the process is kind of smooth, there's like this uh, endurance part of it. Big explosion down there. I'm walking on the side of a mountain. Oh, but also, heck yeah! Uh, really like my body. Here, in Fallout 76. And, uh. I have my moments, IRL, also. Except, uh. I get insecure, I guess. That drop looked pretty dangerous. <laughs> I have died before on similar drops. I'd better walk around. Whew, that was kind of a soft landing. Nice. Plush.
I seem to be coming across a settled area. Oh, a wind chime. Aluminum scrap three. I have a combat shotgun. Ooh. So far, so good. Check out that reload magazine, though. High priority. Like, the double barrel shotgun I was using before is pretty strong. It had like 100 damage each shot. So like 200 damage a clip. Versus this, though, it would be like 560 with the damage I'm using right now. It just uh, eats up the bullets more. Eating the bullets. And uh, spitting them back out like the mask, Jim Carrey. That movie was <laughs> kind of scary when I first watched it. They showed us to a, they showed it to us in like a hmm, preschool or grade school. I think I rewatched it when I was older though. It was better. But like... Uh, it is possible some of the actual themes of the movie might be missed by someone... ...who is of older age. Ooh, ribcage and pelvis. Heck yeah. I have not uh, gone to sleep since the last time I streamed, actually. However, in the situation, it might also be the way to go. I also had a Red Bull. And here is a portrait of some ducks. The ducks. There's a bigger looking facility here. I just grabbed some Psycho. I thought it was food at first. But it was in fact... Drugs. I guess uh, some people live off the stuff. Though it's very unhealthy. It can be uh, quite uh, frightening. Like in that movie. Nightmare Alley. Oh, should I take these knuckles too? I might be able to... Learn a script component if I scrap them. Interesting, is there a Yao Guai here? There was the last time I was here in this area. Ooh, but here's a stash box. Yes! 
Oh, yeah, ribcage and pelvis. What was I going to stash, though? <laughs> I was going to st stash something, man? I should maybe use this guitar sword for now. I think I have gladiator. But I have Iron Fist equipped. Let's see, level 3 Gladiator. Plus 20% damage? Twenty percent. <sighs> oh, there was something I might was gonna pick up the greaser jacket and jeans. Huh. Let me see how that looks. Yeah. I have two pairs. Well. Mm. The first pair might have had a little bit more texture. Alright, let me see. Really nice. Like, this is a good everyday outfit, I think. How is the bottom? How is the bot? Let me see. Could not get the angle there. Oh, really good. Some, some uh, solid sneakers, looks like. Or like, they're kind of like fancy fashion sneakers. And some really nice jeans that are kind of ripped up. Oh, good. God, I love this outfit. I love the way I look. I, I'm feeling, uh, <laughs> I'm feeling, uh, good. Oh yeah, I had to pick up some shotgun shells too. That is a major thing here. Oh yeah, in the future I could just uh, use the top to navigate to it. To certain categories. I have some Salisbury steak stashed here too. And two submachine guns. I should put the perfect storm here for now. I'm gonna drop some stuff too. Eighteen seventy six shotgun shells. Well, do not need that much. I'm gonna pick up five hundred. And I'll pick up these machine guns and this pistol. I should scrap them somewhere. I'm probably over encumbered right now. Let's see. Here's an assault gas mask. I'll take it. I used to wear one of these uh, in Fallout 4, I believe. I put it right on. 
Er, uh, maybe not this, actually. I probably wore something different. Er, uh, but it was kind of like this. Kind of sleek looking. However... I'm not gonna wear the assault gas mask right now. <laughs> uh, black rim glasses. Is, uh, fine by me. That right away is going to reduce some of my radiation as I eat some grilled rad roach. Oh, and you know what? I'm Nuka Cherry in it. Oh, yeah. Uh, looks like I have 69 bobby pins remaining. In middle school, someone explained to me what 69 was. They drew a diagram for me. It was not overtly grotesque. It was with the numbers. And I, I was like, oh, that is what it means. Oh, I, I got some brain fungus here. Oh, that sounds so bad. If you actually had, like, if that was a disease, all right, I'm gonna drop the rest. Hmm. Oh, Mentats. Mentats? Oh, no, I'm gonna take some Day Tripper. Oh, I'm about to get high AF. <laughs> plus three charisma, plus three luck, and two strength for ten minutes. Increases thirst. Oh, yeah. Thirst. For. Oh, here's a cooking stove. <laughs> Chicken noodle soup. It is a classic. Oh, I destroyed those Mirelurks in that Wendigo cave. Alright. They were actually pretty tough, though. The Mirelurk Kings. Ooh, melon juice. Yes. And some blackberry juice. Wow. Wet my lips and call me pleased with that flavor. The sweetness, kind of like a tea almost. Still over encumbered. I'm still vibing. I'm high on the day tripper actually. And I drink a Nuka Cherry. Oh. I am back on the road again. I kind of like the look of my butt, but not in like a gotta have it kind of way, uh, although I, it really would be nice. <laughs> Actually, I guess I guess it is kind of in a gotta have it kind of way, but I'm still figuring stuff out. Oh my god, I'm over encumbered so I will not be able to run. Let me drop some stuff actually.
Oh, I'm carrying power armor parts. Oh, they're not hostile. trained as well. Brotherhood of Steel has a real hardcore ring to it. If I get a gun and a nice suit of power armor, you can sign me right up. You looking to join up too? We'll make Atlas stronger than Fort Defiance ever was. Go home. Let us take care of things here. Wow, that last one was a real piece of work. Oh, snap! Heck yeah! Oh, yes! Are you all about to take out these ghouls? Ha ha ha! Ah, even the third one survived. Ninety-five, interstate. It runs through where I am residing too. Cutting straight through. That looks like the way to go. And then there's a the Baltim Greens along the way. Ah, it might still be a ways also. But these greaser jacket and jeans really helps things along. So good. I was writing poetry once. Powering up Monaga. Ah. Ah, it's one of these. Attention customers. Monaga Power Plant has experienced an unexpected failure. We apologize for the inconvenience. Rest assured that our maintenance crews are working hard to minimize the outage and safely restore power. Based on current projections, most customers should expect power to be restored by... The Monaga Power Plant, it requires uh, multiple people. Or maybe, like, um... Potentially, if one knew where all the levers were... They might be able to speedrun. Or maybe one could just uh, poke around and do some snooping. But I have a um, some stuff I want to do. I wrote this poem once, so I was like... Uh, It was about, like, leather jackets and pantyhose. It, <laughs> I might... I don't know. It's not like uh, a caricature... Uh, it's not a caricature of my character. Though, maybe it is not entirely not a caricature of uh, my person. Because it is indeed true, you know, a nice leather jacket and some nice pantyhose. Really good. Rain, love on me.
Oh, and that person I was speaking about earlier, Dr. PP, I was literally watching them, actually. They had their own opinion of the Twitch versus YouTube thing. I guess they, uh, their conclusion is that Twitch is better, except YouTube is getting better. But the way they said that the algorithm worked for YouTube, it's really unfair for like everyone. I gotta get some stim packs. Oh, I have ten. Maybe I should have picked up more than 500 bullets. I think I can pick some up on the way though. Probably. Stuff on the stem pack. These Supermans really do like this spot. Last time I checked, oh, I was hounded here by two um, racist people. Yeah, I guess that's what they were. <laughs> Scary stuff. I ended up buying a PlayStation camera for my P PlayStation 4. It was um, something I was wanting to add. I was thinking, I was actually initially planning on maybe a time frame of adding it later because I wanted to lose some weight. But then, you know, that's like most of my life. <laughs> uh, there was this one period in my life where I was like pretty skinny. like. Uh, 
Like, you would say I'm healthy in that range, but it, it might have been too skinny. Like, to the point where I was taking damage to myself. But then, you know, like, and then factoring in what people say when they actually say it about, like, healthy dieting and weight loss, it's like, it would not happen in the time span. Or, it might, actually. Some, but, like, not uber significant. It should get here today. I bought it with a copy of, um... Kingdom Hearts All-in-One package. I played Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and 3, of course. I played some Chain of Memories. Big fan. Big fan of the Kingdom Hearts. Let's see. In terms of these Supermans, though. Ah, they're trying to pitchfork me. This one wants to fork me. Oh my god, to fight him I would have to get back on the mountain ridge. Alright, they're gonna survive today. That is a hassle. Also, my armor is breaking. survive that? Oh my god. Maybe not. Attention citizens. Nuclear strike imminent. Please exit the area at your earliest convenience. Thank you for your cooperation. I might do quite a bit of stuff before Kingdom Hearts though, though I do really want to play. The all-in-one package actually included some stuff like uh, Re-Chain of Memories. It was a remake of the Game Boy Chain of Memories and they put it on PlayStation actually. But it was like one of those like spin-off titles, but it's actually not a spin-off title. <laughs> it's like uh, pretty important to the series between Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2. And it has this cool, like, uh, card battling combat system. Then there's, like, 358 by 2 days, which is amazing for the character. Like, really like the character. Protagonist in that one. I played that on a emulator once. Did not finish it, though. And then there's also uh, Birth by Sleep. I think I played... Um, there were three character stories when I last saw. I played through one. It might have been Taro's. There's so many super mirrors about. I can see them. They're in the water. And I have the high ground. A good shot. I won on the land. And beans. Ooh, and a cooking station. However, I think uh, my meat is cooked. And uh, that is what she said. <laughs> Alright, 
custom waypoint is this way. It's also in the direction of the wayward. So yeah, that is some exciting stuff. Um, there's some other stuff I'm looking forward to too. I got a copy of um, Horizon Zero Dawn, the complete edition. I played a little bit of that, the standard edition, before I did not finish. But it's like one of those like I kind of want to finish it, and it's like hailed as like one of the greatest PlayStation Four games, right? And then um, Marvel's Avengers, I got that. I really do uh, love me some superheroes, <laughs> and uh, you know, Marvel's Avengers. It seemed like the like one of the definitive of the genre in terms of video gaming uh, yeah I should probably get to that soon I think there is an online component I do not want to miss out on that uh, unless it's bad but then you know right how do you know <laughs> Mm. The people might be as toxic as uh, the ones in Fallout 76, but maybe not. This is Sutton. Overseer's house is there. I'll actually head up there. There's some workbenches. This one tried to whack me from behind. I think they did. They stabbed me, or they whacked me with a pitchfork. There's another one around here somewhere. There you are. Repent. Repent, ghost. I'll grab these actually. Leader's Journal. Uh, I can't believe how these people are responding. It's even better than I imagined. It's so much easier than trying to round them up and kill them for their stuff. I just need a willing fool to do most of the work for me. There's more every day. Maybe... 
twos or Margaret's? Oh, yeah. I should go with Margaret because nobody will ditch me for an old lady. Oh, Yves. Yves might be able to outstrip me with that silky pompadour and easy smile. I should get him to shave it off. Haha. <laughs> Always with the questions, Margaret, well, I have bad news for you. Nobody who asks that many questions is going to ever self-actualize properly unless they learn how to clear out the barriers that cause them such stress. I'll let her know privately that I think she has a serious problem that only loyalty can help her work through. Maybe she got betrayed in a past life, and that's why she's unable to trust. It's perfect. Margaret found me wearing a new recruit silk uh, pants, and she's beginning to suspect what's really going on. I just have to keep appealing to her vanity so she can teach the new people the ropes. That and smile, uh, you know, be it typically and say profound things so that everyone remembers who is holy and in charge. Not that true. Nobody's following a shrew into enlightenment, Margaret. Okay. Who knew religious people could be so sanctimonious about silken pants? Nobody cares, Margaret, but she's convinced that she's got me figured out that I am corrupt. I told her that I would step down after my next sermon, where I confirm her as the new leader. It's all I could do to keep her from outing me in front of everyone like a complete hag. I've got her fooled, though. I can still make it out of this with all the good stuff. Oh, I didn't think it would be so awful. No wonder they use it on rats. As terrible, I have to go. I can't be here with this. The smell. I'm sure I can find another group that needs my help, just like this one. I just need to find a, a better way to end things next time. Smell's not gonna go, so I may as well. Wow, that was interesting. It was uh, kind of political. Oh, this looks like Fancy Lad Snack Cakes. A lot of people died in that church. Acoustic guitar. I'll try that one after I workbench it up.
Right as rain, I got some armor to repair. Oh, I'm still missing screws and adhesive, however. Also, interesting looking poster. The uh, breastplate caught my eye, which is actually uh, like a dress. Perfect storm goes in the stash box. What do I got here? I got a boxing glove. Black powder pistol. Assault rifle. Someone gave this to me when I first started. Uh, looking back, it was actually not a nice gift. I'm not scrapping that. Alright, Chinese officer sword goes in the stash. Oh, maybe not. I think I can, can just carry it. Two shot short western revolver, though. Whoa, there's a new cola in that lunch pail. Sweet. Ooh, I wonder if there's like... There's a new barrel. Good for a recoil and hip fire. Whew, maybe I'll keep the long barrel for now though. Uh, on second thought, alright, I'm going a line short barrel. It's uh, kind of like the spirit of the shotgun too. Oh yeah, I still got my guitar skills. Alright.
Interesting spot for a plunger. Sometimes, you know, it can be nice to like take a dump in the bathroom. It's kind of like a, a plunger, a natural plunger. In fact, that they modeled the design of the plunger after, like, the intestinal organ, the sphincter? <laughs> I guess that makes sense. I connected the dots, <laughs> like, uh, inversely. There was a person who invented a a device called a life vac. I saw a commercial for it. I saw a couple. And it's like a plunger except for your mouth. But it actually it looks like it prevents like choking. And it, these statistics they were pretty serious. It was like um 15 people die every day from choking and also a children uh, every four days. There was this one time I was in college and I was super high. <laughs> oh, forceful grip. And I was eating food and like, you know, I was just shoving it in my mouth as a high person does and then like I started like choking but I ended up coughing the stuff out but like when you're high I'm not I'm, it might have lasted a while or it seemed like it did uh, nice picture I'll actually not take it because it would end up a scrap also I uh You know, if it's legal, <laughs> that is the condonation. And then even then, you gotta like, you don't gotta, but like, it'd be uh, healthier and more comfortable to do it responsibly, as they say in the commercials, but like, in a cool way. <laughs> Oh, nice. These uh, pink red leaves up above. Quite nice. Quite nice indeed. Let me see if I can get the vantage point on this. See if this works.
Oh my god. The field of view, the angle looks a little like distorted. Unless I, yeah, the legs look a little long. I'm a little tired now, but I'm also kind of glad to be playing some some Fallout. Peaceful, neutral, irritated, impressed, happy, friendly, flirting. Ooh, confident, maybe. Ah. Confidence. All right. Oh, yeah, the saturation really brings out the colors of the different trees. Well, but this one matches, kind of. Huh, interesting. Except it's a little... It matches, but like the brown smudges on the side are kind of weird. Oh, yes. What a delight. All right. The question is whether I should do vintage. Alright, maybe I... Uh. Heck nah. No frame. Let's go. I saw a pose earlier where the head kind of turned down a little bit. I think that is the one I'm waiting on. Oh, well, that one's pretty good too.
I might have got it. I'm not sure that was it though. I got the background either way, which is nice. Let me see. Such a nice photo. Kind of. Oh yeah, I did get it. Such a nice photo. Ayo. Alright, it looks like I'm pretty close to the wayward also. Oh, and uh, of course, take another look at the uh, red foliage. Caught my eye. Oh! Oh, whoopsie daisy. Whoopsie daisy Ridley. Oh. I wonder if uh, they get that one a lot. It was like I was watching another streamer, Amaranth actually. They were playing with uh, someone named Average Jonas. But they said they get the Jonas Brothers illusion a lot. Alright, let's see. The thing I'm actually pinpointed on is this. There's a creature nearby somewhere. That I can use explosive bait on? I do not technically have to go to the the wayward. <laughs> However, I'm not sure if I was supposed to use the bait on these wild mongrels. attacking though. Oh, dog meat. Not my typical mojo. Alright. Why do I place the bait? They're feasting on this rat stack. I think there is some Brahm in here? Oh, but the range is actually here. It's a little small. Maybe I was supposed to use it on the dogs. So can I just place it and then like something will come? Oh, a death claw's coming? Let's hear it for brutal efficiency! Yeah! I guess the trappers didn't mind picking shrapnel out of their quarries. As cool as the trappers were, the diehards were the exact opposite. Don't let their name fool you. We call them that because their stubborn asses refused to give up their dignity. Couldn't bear to commit unprovoked violence. I don't know much about their special tactics. Did they have any? I don't know. Go find a death claw and make friends with it or something. Alright, so... I should probably get going to Lewisburg, actually. Although I could pass, wait, maybe not. It's not on the way. I'll just kind of go south. It might actually be better to initiate the mysteries now.
Oh, so good. I am parched. Oh. All righty then. Even though I picked up 500 bullets, I'm still <laughs> ending up with a negative. Interesting stuff. Looks like someone scavenged the new Coca-Cola. I do believe there is a cooking station up ahead, however. I should take out one of the Brahmin for the meats. These are not under supervision of the wayward. Wow, that was kind of rough. Ugh. Ah. I already shot it though. Ah, this is that place where that person was chained up inside the fridge. That one, yeah. That one lives. Ooh, I can make some more blackberry juice. The mud chops I am going to drop. Ah, I'm really like appreciating the aesthetics of the wastelands today. <laughs> Even if they are in the um hmm the distasteful appreciation of a opossum. Ooh, chili. Ah, oh, they are wearing the pastor's vestments. Reverend Delbert Windsor's. I've already heard the story, but I'll play it on the way. Reverend Delbert Winters here, born and raised in this very town. Met my own church to the responders for their outpost here. And, uh, you're welcome. The responders are on a true mission, you see. Helping folks through thick and thin. Until the heavens open up again and take us all up, anyway. When this all happened, I figured, like most, it was time. <laughs> this was the end. But, but it wasn't. <laughs> 
At first, I thought it was a mistake. That we was missed, forgotten. Maybe we did some wrong. Didn't give enough to charity, maybe. Didn't praise his name, even in the worst of times. Maybe thought some things that ought not to have been thought. So I asked him. I asked how. Why? I fought your wars on Earth. I'm ready to fight them up there by your side. Then, in my despair, I saw some survivors eating raw rat carcass behind the dumpster. You ought to cook that first, I warned them. It seemed obvious. We tried but got sick, they said, covered in their own filth. I realized right then and there that I was being tasked. From then on, I built kitchens, cooked good food, fed anyone who walked up with an empty belly. And I was thankful for my task. <laughs> Next time hell or high water land in my stew, Ooh. I'll be swept clear away with it. But till then, let's share a home cooked meal together, alright? So when this uh, reverend talks about praising the name of their God, I realize, you know, when some people are like, they say the phrase God is good or God is great, they're, they're really just complimenting their own deity. <laughs> uh. But like, what happens when someone's like, my God is better than so-and-so? <laughs> I guess, uh, I don't know, people die. <laughs> or not, actually, right? You, uh, I would assume most of the times it is said like, wars are not thoughts. HP. God has been cool. Shop at Wade Airport. Some intestine. Oh, wow. That's pretty gnarly stuff. People use the intestines to make sausages. I believe that is where the shape of the sausage came from. <laughs> The intestine. It serves as a nice like wrap too. You can just uh, stuff it in there, do sausage stuff, and then uh, chop it up. That is one of the origins.
grenades. I should throw some. Gotta be the barrel, alright? Unless these these people are not as strong. They're stronger. They have more endurance than the ones I was fighting before. I think it might be the new barrel though. I might have to reload it. Throw some extra parts. Which is fine. It's more like surprising that it did not work. Time to commence juggernaut mode. So this is usable, but it's not as leisurely as the long barrel, I think. There's a power armor here. Can I enter it? Ah, interesting. Do I have that fusion core on me? Let's see. Do I get a free set of power armor here? Where do people even get fusion cores, I wonder? And then they gotta recharge them, maybe? Hmm. Alright. Mm. Feels irresponsible to, like, take this without having a plan of using it. <coughs> Let me see about transferring a fusion core. I guess people could collect ones. Alright. Alright, I have one that's 25 charge. Hmm. Let's see here. Ah, you know what? I guess I'll try it out. Maybe not for long though. It's more like uh, experiencing. Experiencing what the power armor is like. My HP is not doing well.
baby. Except the Superman is really just kind of that fast. The HP is getting vicious right here. These Supermans are excellent marksmen. Why this power armor does not provide as much armor as people hype it up to be? Those bastards. Ah, oh, uh, just kidding about the bastards. Except the ones that were racist. Those are bastards. And the ones that were transported. Those are also bastards. Alright, auto stim pack. That was my perk. It's also good for me. I was playing like a lightweight build actually. Oh wait, yeah. So my normal build might actually have enough like endurance capability as like a suit of power armor. Maybe even more. Sex find info. <laughs> Private dating chat girls, hearts. I see. Someone, uh, sex find info drops by for the, to let me know about private day and chat girls. Alright. Well, I got to experience the power armor. It, uh, did not hold up. And that's good. Because, like, it means the perks are good, too. It means, uh, a person has options and how they want to uh, survive on the wasteland. Alright, I'm taking this back to the place I found it. But in case, I, I guess I'll pick up like charged fusion cores. I have one that's like 75 out of 100. In case I do pick up power armor. Probably not, right? Probably not in the next two days. I saw this one person on the highway once. They were, they had pink, bright pink, hot pink power armor. It was pretty nice. It was nice, nice. Ugh. One second. Like my eyes got caught on this lower right. It's the same, um, like food, chems, and coffee. superstitious about numbers. This is gonna be a total of four times I entered and exited a uh, power armor. Today, I believe I might have gotten into like a chassis before, before now.
33 caps. It is like, um, the inverted ball drop. I guess uh, no waves are incoming. Power armor will be recalled in 10 seconds. Alright, I guess that is it for Wade Airport for now. Power armor has been recalled to your inventory. What the heck? Power armor chassis. I better drop the power armor. Does it drop in a plastic bag? <laughs> oh. Oh, it would have been a brown paper bag, maybe. Uh, there's a person I interacted with previous. There's a dipper kid. I feel violated after. It's like, uh. It's like they're still on my skin. Which reminds me, I saw that new, uh, there's a new card game Marvel released, Marvel Snaps. I saw someone playing it. They had a Jessica Jones card. Jessica Jones also rocks a leather jacket. Pretty sweet.
5.56 millimeters. Yeah, somewhere else I, like, got that sense from someone before, I guess, was my father. Except whatever that sense was, it was, like, way heavier on the, uh, the Fallout 76 player I previously mentioned. of these ghouls, they get butchered by these two machine gun tails. Oh, this one is pivoted. Indeed. It was the move. They went for me instead of the turrets. It was the move for them. Like, I took the damage. I was actually expecting them to <laughs> go for the machine gun turrets again. Roku-san. They're spraying like bullets of air. Are there some kind of raider? Are they giving me like a, a salute? Hey. <laughs> oh my. Level 922? This person has seen some shit. <laughs> Probably to be on the wasteland that long. Follow me, signal. All right. Event completed. Ah. Wow, you look so great. I love your outfit. And your hair, actually, too. Sweet looking out. Nice Halloween outfit. It's glow in the dark. Where did Roku-san just go? It disappeared. What the heck? Roku-san came in like some kind of like god figure, <laughs> like a Cheshire cat. I could handle myself in this case though, but like the pizzazz that they demonstrated in that presentation, it was pretty nice.
Alright, next stop is Lewisburg. Ah, Topher is frowning. Or constipated. Not sure which one. Oh, it's the angry one? Ah, oh, I guess this person does not want to be friends. I shall, yeah. I'm not really looking for friends though. Chances are, <laughs> they're bad news. Well, I guess I am actually looking for friends. Because, like, the ones I've met so far would not qualify. Oh, well, uh, I guess this person also fits the bill. They're probably some kind of discriminator, also. Ah, they have a bounty. Get your bigotry away from me. Someone go kill that Alice Cooper. second. I'm gonna head back a little bit just in case I could see someone kill Alice Cooper. That would be pretty sweet. They might be on the map somewhere unless someone already got them. Ah, they fast traveled somewhere. Or someone killed them. Alright, on the way again. One second. Wait a second. Oh yeah. I do not have to uh, redeem Alice Cooper here. It was what I was about to do, but they uh, 
They tried to kill me so bad that they became an outlaw. And in that case, probably bastard. right through the head of that one. They are not a bastard, though. I think in this case, if I had to put money on it, though, they were a bastard. They had, like, nothing to gain, I guess, except, like, sadism. friend too. Ugh. All right. Oh yeah, their friend was uh doing that stuff that neo Nazis do when when people walk by. <laughs> All right, they probably are associated. The power plant. The hydroelectric plant powered a lot of Charleston. A little ironic for a coal country, I always thought. They were so close to getting it back up and running when it all happened. Arr. <clears throat> the neo-Nazis now are actually... Uh... uh you don't even have to worry about them, actually. When I get, when you break it down, they are like, uh, they have more stats than their predecessors, though. In that case, oh, there's a grenade there. <laughs> Somebody go kill those neo Nazi bastards. It was not me, though. I did not have the stats, actually. <laughs> it was 2v1, and they were like triple digit levels.
Ooh, boxing glove spiked mod. I'll take that double barrel shotgun for old time's sake. There's a note here. Oh, this is Charleston. I think I've read this one. It's about carrying this in. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I fell in the water. That was, that was great. That was uh, not too bad. Looks like I'm in Charleston, though. And uh, exit in. Shutdown imminent? Game services are shutting down for maintenance soon? Shit. In less than five minutes, three minutes, 40 seconds about, shutdown? Oh my god. I'm not gonna be able to get far in this quest line. Alright. Around one minute, I guess. I guess I gotta head out. I guess I'll take a look at this boat. <clears throat> Fuck, there's so many, so many Nazis <laughs> playing, playing Fallout 76. <coughs> it's understandable because of the, the, the developers. The storyline. But it's also true, like, it's really up in my eyes, because, like, people talk about the amount of Nazis you encounter in, like, the workplace and sh stuff. <laughs> Those are the ones who might cause some trouble. And then, like, right, there was that Martinez from California who just got, like, outed. They got fired, though. They got fired. Someone got him. And then, you know, they might kill you also. Just, uh, you know, keep your wits about you. You know best. Or like, you know, whatever your process is. If you do find yourself in a precarious situation. <laughs>
Alright. Clock is ticking down. It's about time to exit. Ah, Mothman. Oh my god. Are they trying to battle me right now? It looks like, uh... They just wanted to put on a show. Yeah, alright. Alright, that is about it. Oh, 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 oh! Let's see. Oh, this is a special appearance. I usually don't show this part in the broadcast, like the exiting. I wonder how long the maintenance is gonna be. I'll probably be able to be back on tomorrow. Be safe.